Now that you're sure you've got the right door closer, let's get to work. Start with the door closed. Determine the position for the jam bracket. The straight edge of the bracket should be 2 and 1 8 inches away from the door. Make sure the bracket is facing the right way with the straight edge away from the door. Install the jam bracket using the four longer screws. If you're not using existing holes, you may want to drill pilot holes to avoid splitting the wood of your door frame. Now, open the door and slip the hold open washer onto the rod. Attach the door closer to the jam bracket using the closer pin. Pull open the door closer a bit. Slide the washer past the lugs, lining it up with the mark on the rod. Release the closer so that the washer is now holding it open. This is called pre-tensioning the closer. Close the door and line up the bracket so that it's touching the door. If your existing holes don't match up, you may need to drill new ones. Install the bracket on the door. Note how the torsion bar flexes as you secure the bracket on the door. With the installation done, let's test the door closer. Open the door. Note how our spring-loaded speed release washer auto-releases when you open the door. Let your door close. It should shut smoothly and securely. If your door doesn't close, or the speed is too fast or too slow, you can adjust the tension on the door closer. At the far end of the door closer, you'll find a tension screw. Turn the screw counterclockwise to have the door close faster or harder.